I'm Shirin Ong. Thank you for your interest in redefining leadership. We have the pleasure of having Jerry Davis and Stephen Langton with us today. Now, gentlemen, welcome and thank you for joining us today. Now, both of you have global responsibilities at Hydrogen Struggle, so the topic of corporate leadership must be really close to both your hearts. So why do you feel the need to actually come up with this book? Yeah, as Hydrogen Struggle's partners in the region, uh, across most of the countries in Asia, have come to understand patterns and understand things that are, that are not researched about what is leadership in Asia evolving into. At a time when the rest of the world is trying to evolve into understanding that so that we can move from clumsiness in working in Asia to real collaboration. And what this book is representing is the captured opinion of our partnership more than ourselves in a duty to share that uh, to ensure that leadership going forward is less accidental. Right. And uh, Jerry, if I may direct the, uh, the next question to you. Now, in the book, you talked about the need to lead across multiple markets, cultures, and, um, and generations in Asia. So what leadership challenges do all these present? Oh, they're enormous. Um, but primarily, it's, it's to do with learning. Uh, it's to do with um, uh, flexibility, agility. It's the ability to identify trends and respond appropriately. It's, it's the ability to articulate the challenge, the objective, and then engage, enrol, uh, innovate and energise uh, your teams to go out and capture that hill, to capture that market and uh, realise your vision. And one of the themes of the book uh, is recognising that today we're very focused to this economic storm. But there is a much more sinister storm brewing behind the economy. The economy eventually will get better. But behind it is a story which is not going to get better. Uh, and it's the change in the structure of populations around the world. The Western world's population is shrinking at an extraordinary fast rate. So we are going to see this demand of leadership is no longer going to be about nice to have, let's get talent. It's going to be about get enough people. And that theme comes through in the book, looking at this next perfect storm once the economy's finished with us. Right. And Jerry, what do you want readers to take away after reading this book? I think a number of things. Um, one is that uh, leadership is very much a, a journey. Uh, it's, a, it's a journey through uh, their career. Um, it's a journey that requires a commitment to lifelong learning. Um, it's, it's, a, it's a journey that requires ongoing curiosity and seeking to understand both uh, people that uh, they engage with within their teams, uh, within their client base and across the broader organisation. Um, once they understand that and are sensitised uh, to those people, their relationships, their dreams, their aspirations, they know far better, far better space than to align and bring together resources to secure their business objectives. Thank you. The book Redefining Leadership Competing in Asia in the 21st Century will be launched in mid-April and will be available in bookstores and on Amazon.com.